hello hello welcome to a new vlog guys you're catching me taking out this hair it has served its time as you can see honestly it's really served its time but to be honest it actually surprised me by how long i had it for so yeah i think everyone does this you have your cup paper bag where you put your braids as you're undoing you just keep putting putting then you just tie the paper bag and you throw Ama. <laughs> I want to undo myself, you know, just to save some coins. <laughs> I'm gonna undo the hair myself and then I'm just gonna go to a salon to close by and I get it washed. Um, we've been having an issue with water, guys. Ah, so I would have to um, wash my hair in a bucket, which I don't mind, but it's just a bit taxing. Like, I prefer if I'm washing my own hair, I'm washing it in the shower. So not that I'm washing it in a bucket. So I'm just going to go to the salon. Um, and then I'm just going to do lines because I'm going back to the wig life. In fact, I got a new wig today that I have to film for. So, yeah, I need to do lines for that. For the wig life. Uh, 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 uh. I think this one is a red. Ooh, I can't wait to see it. I think it's a red wig. I think I wanna. Oh my god, you guys just witnessed the first time my camera has fallen down. My brand new camera. Can you imagine? Anyways, it'd be like that, I guess. Sad. Sad, sad, sad. I'm trying to hurry up because it's kinda late. Imagine. <laughs> Today we woke up nicely, got ready to go to the gym, and then we ended up going to the to the shop to do like window shopping for some things we are looking for. We never made it to the gym, and we've come back home at three thirty p.m. So you know, some days it's just like that, you know. <laughs> some days it's really just like that, and then we are influencing each other badly. At we get there, Ama, we just go. Amma, we just, Amma, and then we don't end up doing anything. So, anyways, ooh, this is really cute. It looks cute when it's short. So, I actually have a couple of packages here. I have one here I collected from DHL. So, the funny thing about this package is I didn't know who it, who it was from. DHL calls me and they're just like, you have a package, where should we drop it off? Where should we deliver it? And I'm like, a package from where? Because I'm not actually expecting a package. And they're like, it's from Nigeria. I'm like, what? I don't know anyone who would be sending me a package from Nigeria. So, I mean, to open, it's actually from YouTube Black. I still don't know why it went through Nigeria. I don't know. But anyways, <laughs> their packaging is always on point. I've already opened so i'm not gonna act surprised here for the vlog i'm sorry <laughs> so it's actually from youtube black there we go there's a little note um hey joanna kinuthia it's been a while since we saw you last year at the youtube black programming and wanted to let you know we miss you and really appreciate your continuous continued guidance and partnership it's just um a nice note and then so i think they've given information on what this is yeah so this they've collaborated with the amazing artist mohammed fadera to bring you something special guys this is really nice and then it has my name over there at the bottom this is really nice i'm actually gonna put it up right there so thank you youtube black Kwanza, hey, hey, I have a story for you guys. Let me tell you. I don't know if you've seen this um, inaugural YouTube something something going around. I know Patricia Kihora is part of it. Kaluhi and Michelle. Um, I saw it. So, let me tell you guys. Do you know, this is what happened. They sent me a link. They said, sign up. Sign up. They kept reminding me, you have 
um what this many days to sign up sign up some sign up someone from the team actually sent me a whole email telling me to sign up guys they sent me a, she sent me an email and she was like jenna have you seen this sign up me there it was at that point in the year where i was so tired i was opening emails and i just i couldn't i just couldn't so i would just say i'm gonna do it later i'm gonna do it later i'd never even opened to see what the whole registering or signing up or applying was all about like what i was applying for i didn't even open and then now is when i see oh my god like there's this whole big youtube thing inaugural class and i was just like joanna and that is how i learned never to ever 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 put off an email you just can't don't put off an email just i could just do it just respond to the email when you get it because you never know by the way you just never know boy that one still pains me today but everything happens for a reason <laughs> that's how i console myself everything definitely happens for a reason and maybe it was actually just not my time um for this thing which is okay it's okay if there's another chance i will take it i will take that opportunity for sure so guys don't put up your emails imagine by the way do you have it does anyone have any one of those stories please comment down below where there's like a opportunity a good one and you just ignored it and then later on is when you realized hi hey, yeah if i just responded to that email or that phone call i could have been the one who got that gig does anyone have a story like that comment down below please make me feel a bit better anyways if a wig so you know i'm about to do a wig video with this <laughs> obviously one thing i want to do less of this year is wig videos though um i think the other time i was really doing them a lot the thing is that they actually pay really well and you know i like wigs and i like money <laughs> i like wigs and i like money but um i think that i want to do them a lot less this year i want to do them a lot less you know not wig video wig video wig video wig video at least we can do wig video a vlog maybe i can sit down video somewhere another wig video a vlog you know to spread things out so ooh, i don't think i've ever ever had a red wig before what she's fiery guys she is fiery the thing is nowadays i actually work with very select um wig companies reason being i got a lot of feedback that some of these companies when you buy from them they actually send you something that is not what they sent me so for me they send me something good and then for the people who are buying they send something substandard but now the companies i work for that uh, work with rather this one eva there's also her given hair that one love it and there's another one called divas wigs so those are the three main ones that i work with because they actually have really good hair they have like they're doing well they're doing well so i'm about to be working this i'm excited for that anyways guys i'm gonna undo this hair quickly 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 so that i can go to the salon i'm just gonna go to the local salon here um <laughs> those ones don't care whether you're a naturalista trying to maintain length or cgo they will blow dry the hell out of your hair that's for sure you can count on that <laughs> well now me this thing of losing the comb now that one is what i don't like losing the comb oh actually now that we're here i also got some new i think in the last vlog i was telling you guys how my benzoyl peroxide has been becoming ineffective so quickly so i actually had to get a new one because if you guys have noticed my skin has started breaking out a little and it's just not looking fabulous as fabulous as i would want it to so i got a fresh pack of the benzoyl peroxide i got this from rc accessories on instagram i actually went there physically to their shop and i had asked them to tell me um for how long they've had it so they told me they got it on friday because i don't want to buy something that's been on the shelf for two months i mean when i get it it means it's gonna like it's already set on the shelf with all that change of temperature and all 
I mean, by the time I get it, it will stop working or stop being ineffective very quickly. Because the thing about these products, this is the glycolic acid, they have active ingredients. And active ingredients are sensitive to the elements. They're sensitive to the change of weather. So even when you have them, you're supposed to put them in a really cool place. For me, usually I actually put them in the fridge. I don't think you have to put it in the fridge, but you should put it in a nice, cool environment so yeah i'm hoping that now my skin is gonna pop you know pop proper proper popping anyways guys let me just now be serious aki where is that comment you just here sincerely ah uh, ah uh, ah uh. i've been thinking about your smile I've been thinking that I can't let you go Hey, can you wait a little while? Why we're holding back, I don't know I guess I'm all confused about you, about you You're my one temptation, yeah Update, guys. I did one and I said nope i am not doing anymore so i'm just gonna go get them taken out in the salon i do a wash conditioner and i just do my school girl lines that's it i don't know why i pretend to that i don't really care about you maybe i'm indifferent maybe i'm not thinking straight God, why does this happen? I forgot my damn mask. <sighs> Let's get it. Because obviously, you know, I'm not. Oops. Uh, anti mask. So. I'm just here. In fact, I have a whole pack of masks in my car. So. I can never lack one. So as you guys can see, I have my lines on. This is how I'm working out. Honestly, sometimes I see people in the gym working out with a wig on. I just can't. Imagine I can't. I just can't. Anyways, morning guys. Happy Friday. Last workout of the week. We missed yesterday, so we have to make up today. So I'm just checking in. I'll take you guys along for my workout today. Whew. If I'm already tired going up the stairs, it's about to be brutal. Okay, we're ready to go. We're doing glutes today. So we have those for lunches. We have these for our uh, hip thrust, for our bench, for other stuff. We're ready to go. We just did cardio. So we only start with like 10 minutes of cardio. Then now we get into, you know, the real stuff. <laughs> Sanitize your equipment. <laughs> Always sanitize your equipment. Corona or not, sanitize.
guys i'm back home i hope you guys enjoyed watching my gym session i don't always love sharing what i'm up to in the gym online because i feel like there's so so many trainers online and everyone is just like do this you're not doing it right do it like this do it like this and like i know it comes from a good place but sometimes it's also just like you know like ease off you know like just chill you know um actually along those very lines i was just telling my sister today hmm, and you guys please confirm if this happens to you in the comments as well if you go to the gym and you don't have a trainer right do you find it annoying when trainers like are marketing themselves to you like all the time in fact for me that's not the issue for me the issue is more of the way they do it they kind of like bring you down almost make you feel like what you're doing is trash and then it's like oh yeah but you know i can train you you know like you know they come and they'll say something like your form is off or you know you guys are not really pushing yourselves or you're not doing this or you're not doing that and i don't just I just don't feel like that's a very effective way for you to market yourself if you're trying to get a client like why are you making me feel bad about what i'm doing and then expecting that i'm gonna sign up what's not clicking what's not clicking i'm not gonna sign up with you you're making me feel bad about how i'm doing or my body or you know and then you expect me to be like oh yeah let me like get you as my trainer how how you know anyways 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 so i wanted to show you guys these cards because they've been really lifesavers for me if any of you is um like me and you don't carry around much cash i highly recommend that you get these cards so instead of like getting that cheap coin or sometimes it's a paper whatever it is and then going to a machine to pay your parking like hey, me sometimes i used to struggle because i just don't carry around cash i've gone cashless and i think i mean also because of covid like we're all trying to reduce how much cash we're working with so these two cards really come in handy and this isn't sponsored anyways i can't be mentioning two brands in the same <laughs> in the same breath but uh you just load the card with mpesa via mpesa and then when you're entering the mall you just tap when you're coming out you just tap and it just cuts the money from the card so this one is paytech this one i think works in junction sarit uh two rivers uh it works in a couple of of malls so a good number of malls and other parking lots also because sometimes i when i go to town i park in cardinal, cardinal otunga plaza and it works there as well that's actually where i got it from and then i also have this one the cups one this one doesn't work in too many places i think the place i've used it um so far is village market i haven't don't think i've used it anywhere else i don't even remember where i got this to be honest like what place i got it i can't even remember but anyway yeah highly recommend by the way and then you just come out of your car go do your thing come back to the car you don't have to start thinking eh did i carry my chip did i carry my cg what did i you're just tapping tapping so by the way guys i'm vlogging on my phone i don't know if you can usually tell a difference can you um in the quality of my phone and my camera it would be a damn shame if you couldn't tell the difference because I spent the cash on a <laughs> I spent the cash to get a camera and then you guys are like, oh no, we can't see a difference. I'll be lucky heartbroken. I'll be lucky heartbroken. I got this bottle from the gym. There's a day though Kericho Gold was outside the gym, again not sponsored. And they have these cold brews. Hey, I hope you guys are just as nini we're all washambas here i hope so because i didn't know what a cold brew was like i hear it in vlogs you know the ones i watch for the us <laughs> and they're always like i mean i mean not always but they talk about you know this cold brew that cold brew and i'm just like anyways what else so they have cold brews which are just like tea bags that can be activated in cold water because you know kawaida tea bags you can't activate them in cold water you have to use hot water but this one you actually put it in cold water 
and it's just supposed to encourage you to drink more water and so far i actually like them um they gifted me two flavors i like one the other i don't like it too much by the way i won't lie there and actually let me go to the house i show you guys okay guys tell me is there a difference in the camera quality because now i've switched to my camera and the phone quality please comment down below and let me know anyways so these are the cold brews i'm talking about so this is cucumber lemon and mint this is not my favorite flavor i don't actually like it too much but this i actually like the orange pineapple and coconut it tastes like juice but from very far and then juice without sugar so it's actually making the water taste really good and then now these are the two tea bags and then you just take this out pop it into your water and it's flavored and yeah i think these are really nice if you struggle with water morning guys eh, my voice is still a bit groggy <clears throat> I actually woke up a while ago i've just in my, in my been in my bed just scrolling through social media but uh it's 9 a.m now and i want to get my day started it's actually a saturday and i'm working today because <laughs> yesterday was my saturday yesterday was friday i exchanged with today because um i couldn't shoot because the sun the weather was a bit off so the lighting in my videos or photos would not have been good well that's what i'm telling myself because at some point the sun came out but i was like already you know chilling watching vlogs drinking kombucha and i was like me i wake up and i film me and i wear makeup me me no 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 so by the way guys there's something i've noticed and i've also done it that um uh content creators youtubers influencers whatever it is do which is apologizing for their appearance like maybe you know if they're not glammed up maybe they haven't worn their wig and you know you'll notice someone is like hey guys i know i look a mess you know just ignore that sorry about that and i'm just like well imagine we're not doing that in 2021 who do we owe a good appearance who who I just know guys we don't owe anyone a good appearance we look the way we look if you've just woken up you've just woken up you don't look a mess you just look like you've just woken up so we're not apologizing for how we look in 2021 because we actually do not owe anyone looking glammed up or looking put together you know what i mean so <clears throat> if you guys catch me saying that i need you to i need you to stop me i need you to stop me anyway so today is a major content shoot day i'm trying to bulk shoot guys i'm really really trying to bulk shoot because i just have other things yeah other things i was gonna say projects but no not projects other things that i have to work on during a work week so i can't be doing i can't be filming every day or every other day you know and i also don't want to just wear makeup every day so <clears throat> i want to try and be bulk shooting a week's worth of content and even editing it yani it's just sitting in my phone ready for me to post and then now on the other days of the week i can now focus on you know other things i mean it's not that i won't film during the week um sometimes things come up or you're just touched by the spirit of filming and you want to film um but for the most part no and then now during the week i can focus on joanna k cosmetics you know giving my all to joanna k cosmetics and stuff like that so um what i've done i've just written down in my can notebook here content shoot day 23rd of january so i have the youtube content i want to film i have a wig oh it's so stunning i have a wig looking at me there that i want to film for um what else yeah so i've actually written some notes down for the wig video i'm gonna film because i think i want to try and give more value in my wig videos rather than just make it a review of a wig video i want it to be more of um like i'm teaching something in each week video not just this is from this company this is how it is this is how it is um i want to try and you know i'm teaching you something so today i think i'm gonna do you know how to lay your wigs down with glue something 
for beginners something really detailed um then i have some two sit down videos that i want to film for youtube one is about business one is about skincare so i'm gonna film that and then then now i have written down all the content that i have to film now for my instagram so and then i'll take photos ideally i feel like i should have like some idea of the kind of photos i want to take but i haven't done that so i'll just let the spirit guide me to what photos to take <laughs> so yes let's get the day started guys let's get the it's a work day it's a very busy work day so it's time to get this day started here's the wig i'm about to film with i love that red it's an ombre red i'm gonna show you guys once i install it right now i want to do a mask so i've actually just taken it out of the fridge so it's gonna feel really good i started using my acne.org glycolic acid again i had stopped using it and it's just it's like it's causing some sort of a reaction because i'm just feeling very itchy and very dry around this area and usually uh what happens is when i feel like that it's gonna like leave a key dry patch that's just how i'm feeling so this is the mask I've reached for calming and soothing um, aloe vera because I feel like it's actually going to soothe whatever the hell is going on right now. So, that's what I'm going to use. And putting it in the fridge. Ugh. Oh, the mask is from Uncover. So, yeah, I've used their masks before. They were gifted to me and i really like them honestly i haven't used the aloe vera one but i'm just guessing that you know because it's aloe vera it's gonna be soothing ah the sun is boring me it's coming in and out oh that feels so good <laughs> feels amazing so let's see i actually really like how they've done the instructions honestly the way they've done this whole mask the packaging the instructions at the back can you guys see you know even just to small things the fact that they've used a black girl <laughs> in the demo we love to see it um so i'm gonna leave it on for a 20 minutes that 20 minutes was longer than I expected, so uh, I love that glow it gives when you take it off. Oh my god. Oh wow. That feels good. That feels good, 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 good. I'm actually gonna take some of the serum from in here. I put it on my neck. Mm-hmm. Perfect too. <sighs> let me let that just dry off then moisturize sunscreen and we get this filming started i really love burning a candle when i'm filming this one in particular i think i showed you guys this in the last vlog the mjine home apple caramel cake ah love it and you guys can see it's burnt so perfectly love it I mean, the sun is playing and it keeps coming in and out and I don't know what this is all about because today I have no choice but to film. So please, let it just cooperate, please. Hey guys, Ooh, check me out. I look so good actually, by the way, I look so good. I look so, so good. Um, I think this is my first time actually trying a red wig and I feel like I it really looks good so of course the wig video is done i've done another video still in progress i have one more to do and then i moved the ig content so ah, we're doing we're pushing we're pushing we're pushing i had to use my ring light in conjunction with the natural light because the natural light kept coming in and out and it's still doing that but at least now when like there's a cloud that covers the sun the ring light nini takes over the ring light she clears at least so that the video is not so dark so anyways let me continue i just love this wig so much and i think i actually did really a really good job laying it you know it's been a minute since i actually laid a wig i can't even remember 
okay it's not that long ago maybe october november last year so hey i thought you know i had lost my skills but no 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 the skills are there the skills are there anyways guys i think i'm gonna end the vlog here um i hope you've enjoyed it uh thank you guys so much for watching um yeah i'm gonna see you in the next one you know i have many sit down videos coming at you guys i'm also vlogging um it's just like all around all around content so you know i might start putting out more than one video per week now um let's see how it goes my minimum um that i set for myself for posting a youtube video is one so one youtube video per week but now i'm just like you know what um if i can do more then why not so yeah guys support all the content you see give it a thumbs up if you're new here and this is your first vlog uh watching hey you might have been floating a bit but you'll catch up <laughs> you'll catch up uh anyways guys i'm gonna enjoy the rest of my weekend